Could you even see that? Probably not. We're holding on to my glasses. All right, we'll know now if there's something in here. Ah! Oh, yeah! Did you hear that? Man, hello, oh, oh. that's a little hard with my glasses on. So what's up, did you see that? I was almost juggling with two things. Back at the ranch, back at the ranch. You see what I got? I got the couplings. Well, I got a couple couplings. We gotta put them on the pipe in the pond. Let's go check out the pond. Oh, I look, it's stuck right there. Man, I will say this. I, Renee, I haven't seen you in the comments here lately, but uh, I really do appreciate these, uh, the glasses strings. I'm really kind of taking, uh, wow, oh man, this is going to be a mission. Um, back to the string. Uh, thanks again for the string, Renee, because I'm starting to learn how to utilize them better and make it work. And I got the tip tucked inside my shirt. And so, uh, yeah, I'm really happy about that, but <sighs> Holy cow, you guys aren't gonna believe this. Man, oh man, well, this is gonna be a little bit more of a mission than I thought. <laughs> okay, what you gonna do now, Willis? Look at this. Look how much water is in the pond. Holy cow. The dock is underwater. My pipe that I gotta fix is way down there. Are you kidding me? Well, that's awesome, that's cool. It's really cool that we got a lot of water in the pond. Ain't that right, Mr. Duck? But what's not cool is I didn't get the pipe fixed in time. I guess I'm about to get in there now, I don't know. Man, this is, well, what are you gonna do now, Willis? So the pigs definitely been back. They've been rooting around the, the water's edge there. Definitely a lot, of, a lot of life in the pond. The minnows are stirring around the water bugs. I'm sure the fish that were in the other side there and in here are really happy now they got a lot more pond to swim in. I, on the other hand, I'm gonna have to get in the pond. Let me go, let me, I think Jeremy's got those wading boots up here. Let me go see if I can put those on. So I really wasn't expecting the pond to be that high because last time I was here just a few days ago, it was, it was just, it was close. Like the, the broken pipe was just under the water, so it shouldn't have been too difficult to get to. However, at this point in time, there is a, oh, there's those boots. Cool, so maybe I can put those on if they'll fit. But at this time, I'm going to have to borrow these waders uh, that way I can um, get into the pond. Let's see. I'm not sure if these are big enough. I don't know the size on them. 13. Oh, yeah, perfect. Cool. Oh, there we go. So the plan is this I'm going to go ahead and borrow these waders. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and walk down into the water to see if i can even reach the other the broken end of the pipe and see if we can come up because i'm gonna have to get it up out of the water so i can glue it and get it together so hopefully to have enough flex i don't know but we're going to find out here in just a second and if not i might be kind of out of luck at this point until the water goes back down i guess but unfortunately i don't think that's going to be anytime soon so let's see what we can do I definitely need to get on this dock and get it complete. Ain't that right, Mr. Pig? That's pretty cool, right? So while I'm sitting here uh, and putting on these waders, hopefully there's nothing down inside them. Make sure I don't put my foot down in there. Oh, wow, look at that. Matt, oh man, that would have sucked. 
Imagine if I'd have put these on. Look at that. Oh, wow. Two wasp nests right there. One and two. Imagine if I'd have brought these down and uh, put my legs in those things and the wasps were on there. And that'd be fun. So, yeah, I broke the handle on that thing, unfortunately. That's what I found in the bottom of the pond over there. All right, so that makes it a little bit more sketchier to put my foot down in here. Go ahead and make sure. All right, I think we're good on that side. Yeah, at least I hope we're good. Ah! Oh, I think that was one of the... <laughs> Something just flew out of there. I think that was one of the wasps. I'm not sure. Man, now you want to put these things on. I have my glasses on to make sure. Look down in them. You guys see me up shaking it now. I'm listening too. <laughs> yeah, again, Renee, thanks again so much for the ropes. I'm really starting to learn how to use them. And it's really starting to help out. Uh, we're holding on to my glasses. All right, we'll know now if there's something in here. Ah! I don't know. Ah! I don't know if that was just me thinking that or if there really was something in there, like a frog, like a little frog. Ah. I'm feel them out. Again. You saw the wasp nest in there, that's what got me already sketched on this. Try it again. All right, All right we're good there. All right, good there. On the way here, I have my phone plugged in. I think it was charging. Well, the phone was plugged in, but the charger wasn't, so I'm gonna have to check my battery. Hold on. Still got a few minutes left, so definitely feels weird wearing this. Let me go ahead. You guys ready to go in the water? So I might be in a little luck. Looks like the end of the pipe is right here. Oh, yeah. Got this part. Oh, my God. So I think what I'm gonna have to do, because the pipe is a little short, I'm gonna have to cut the pipe up there under the dock. That way I can pull it out, get it together, let it secure or get glued. And then being the pipes up there closer to the top of the dock, I don't think it the water's gonna be a little bit longer before it gets up there, so I'll be able to continue to work on it up there, but know that it will be connected down here. Man, look at all the minnows in here. Holy moly. This is cool. Let's see. So again, I'm gonna go up under there. I'm gonna cut it up there, like slide the pipe down, and then uh, maybe I'll try and find the old one. I don't know. I don't have the money right now to get the other, to start a whole new pipeline just yet, so we're still gonna mess around with this. Yeah, so. I'll get my shovel, I'll dig it out a little bit, and obviously that's going to be the direction of the pipe. So we'll try and find it out there somewhere a little bit, but uh, we're going to go ahead and cut it right there so we can uh, work on it. So I'm pretty excited about that to where uh, we're going to be able to get that together now. I was a little, I was a little worried just because of the fact of how, how deep the pond is already, but uh, as you can see, we're going to be able to get to it and get it together. And then... We're gonna still continue to hunt for that pipe. So, what was I doing? Oh, I was getting my sweat rags. I was doing it first, but um, yeah, we'll get that rest of my PVC stuff and uh, we'll get that get that pipe fixed. You guys remember these? Uh, 
Man, my elbow's killing me. I'm not sure. But I, uh, oh, come on. Oh, there it goes. I smacked the bull in that pole bar and I smacked my funny bone, which wasn't so funny. Oh, man. It has been killing me super fierce. Oh, man, that hurts so bad. All right, we got that cut. I'm not sure if I was filming myself. All right, we got that cut. Got that cut off. Now it's time to get back down in there and uh, get those together. Look at all the minnows. You see them around the pipe? It's awesome. All right. You gotta cut the cap off the other one. But I wanna do that out of the water and keep it up out of the water in hopes that uh, A big enough coupling? I hope I did. Okay. Thank goodness. Did you hear that? It's like a pig drum. We'd like to get the on this end. So now we got the fountain hooked back up. Hope it still works. So now, I, mean, I got to sit on a brick right there. But uh, now that that's uh, glued together, I got to give me a short little piece of pipe I'll find eventually that I'll go ahead and put back in here. Because you can see right here. Wow. I just need a little bit. <laughs> Literally like just <laughs> an inch or two. So... I'll find a piece somewhere. I got one in here. No, no one inches. But um, I'll find one to get that piece together. But right now, let's find the rest of this pipe. Actually, let me go ahead and go take this off that brick. Now it's all dry. Back in here. All right, there we go. Hope that's good. Well, that's done. What you thinking, Mr. Duck? So I think I'm done in the water for a while. I'm gonna go ahead and take these. Actually, I can't take them off. I got some shoes on. Shoes over here. Take this stuff off because it's hot. This things don't ventilate at all. But uh, kept me dry. I got the other. Oh, cut another coupling. Well, it's hot to begin with. Oh, bless you. Oh, there it is. Thank goodness I didn't put those on. And those wasps nests, those wasps come out, come out at me. All right, those wasps nests was done. That was good. <laughs> I'm not sure. I think they're just as wet from the sweat. Uh, so, boy, that'd be cool, cooler now that uh, I got these off. He's falling. So I kept hearing that grunting noise. I'm gonna walk over here and see if we can see if it is one of the pigs. It's been kind of loud, so they might have took off, but nevertheless, if you rewind, I'm pretty sure you'll be able to hear it. Could have been a bullfrog, I don't know, but definitely loud and grunting. A ton of fresh deer track down here. So you can definitely see down there where some of the sand had washed down. I think that's pretty cool. I think we're gonna have to, uh, before it gets too high over there, go ahead and dump some sand down there to where that, like I talked about before, one of those last videos where we just make that like the beach area where you can walk into the pond if you want. But uh, 
Definitely got a lot more water in it. I totally forgot. I was supposed to be plowed. I was going to walk over here and see if I saw that pig. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's gone now if it was. I know some of you mentioned in the comments about if this was high enough to fit Hulk Smash under. Unfortunately, it's not. I could, I could maybe modify it a little bit, but we're we are going to get that area, this all cleaned up back here, uh, little by little, as uh, time goes on. And you guys keep watching, like, and subscribing, hitting that notification bell. Don't forget to hit that notification bell because, as you guys see, I'm putting out a lot more content. Uh, you know, I'm trying to hit at least a 30-minute video almost every day if I can, except for um, Saturdays and. Uh, on Tuesdays we do our lives, but uh, I'm gonna try and get as much as I can out. I hope you guys are liking the 30 minute videos. I know some of you are like, oh, it's too short, but some are like, oh, it's great. So leave a more comment down below. What do you guys start thinking about uh, my shorter videos and trying to be more, more active with it, keeping you guys just having fun. Cause I do, I really, really do appreciate you guys watching and, and you guys having fun. Cause it makes it even that much more fun for me. So thank you guys very, very much. And I guess I gotta try and find this pipe now, right? Oh man. Mr. Pig said, get to work, Willis. I'm going to go ahead, and there's a pipe right here, heading back towards the house. I'm going to go right up here in front of these bushes. I'm going to dig down right there and see if I can find something. Stay right, right in here somewhere, I think. So I'm going to dig down. Obviously, I'm not going to dig over there. There's going to be a lot of roots, so let's get the shovel. What? My elbow hurts so bad. So I hear some helicopter in the distance. Let's see if I can get to it. Oh, it's one of them cool double sided bladed things. Oh. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I've always been infatuated by helicopters, so I always try and film them when I see them. Okay, let's get back at it. Yes, yes, I know the grass needs to be mowed. We'll get to that, but I am definitely going to go ahead and put some uh, sand over here for the beach. I think that's gonna look good. Coming back. There it is. Come down here to the ranch, guys. That's a big helicopter. What you think about that, Hulk? Yeah, so those helicopters are always fun. Um, you know, I'm sitting there digging with a shovel. My elbow is just absolutely just ridiculously killing me. So I'm gonna go get Hulk Smash, and I'm gonna line up kind of where I think the pipe is, and I'm just gonna gently dig out the ground closer to the shed. That way I can see exactly where the pipe's at, and then maybe I can kind of better locate it over there. The closer I find it to the actual pump, the less piping I have to purchase. So let's get Hulk Smash. Oh, look. See, need to put those around your neck, buddy. Actually, I took them off because I was taking my shirt off. So, definitely a lot of action in the pond. It was actually quite relaxing just sitting here. I was sitting here working on a video and just sitting there looking across the pond and watching all the, the meadows get ate by the little brim that are in there. I might actually try and go catch some fish on the other pond eventually and bring them over here and throw them in here. Now the pond's back up and we're getting close to having the pipe fixed and the well going, and uh, and we'll keep this pond full and stuff oh it's gonna hulk smash but you know what i want to do the beach first let's do the beach yeah that's that's gonna look good yeah i'm gonna dump a bunch of sand right here along this edge that way when it fills up it'll look really nice 
one good thing is the uh it's got some cloud cover so the sun is sun is being hidden right now which i'm not complaining because it makes it a little bit nicer out i'm not just actually dripping a pool out of my body nice and clean i am gonna do some more in the seat uh like i said before uh that soap i had just wasn't didn't actually work that well so let's get that sand <laughs> And I told myself today, grab the rake. Well, let's grab the rake. When I grab the shovel, I'm like, I'm not gonna be using the rake. I need to rake that stuff and I ain't gonna rake. But yeah, once I spread that out a little bit, I gotta pick up those bricks, get it over here, and the water fills up, it'll look really good. I'll probably put another load over there, a couple more around the corner there. Uh, so maybe like three more loads here on this side. I ain't got the rake, but you know what I do got? I got that shovel. My fancy ninja shovel moves, right? That was pretty cool. Oh, oh there's a big old buck stack. Right here. That's that big one. Oh, look. I think those are the pig tracks right there. Deer and pig. They are having a party in the Wood the Hills Ranch. It's just sand. That's looking good, isn't it? The sand's looking good. And then, uh, and then we'll get to that pipe. We're gonna find that pipe. I'm telling you, we've done the last one. See, so yeah, I think I'm gonna spit on myself, but find the next one. There you go. There was a dragonfly just flying right beside me. I stuck my finger out and he landed on it. Oh man, that was cool. Well, got some sand down here. I gotta get the rake and definitely, I'm gonna put one more pry here, push it off, then I'll get in here and kind of rake it out. Maybe no one over there. I'll probably wait over there for right now. But again, just kind of rake this out and right around the corner here. That'd be nice. So I've looked around the ranch to see if I can find a rake. I couldn't find a rake, so I'm gonna have to use a shovel. I'm gonna jump down there and uh, use the shovel and get the stuff spread out. I know, we're still going to look for the pipe. I just got sidetracked on the beach over here, so, you know, what the hell is the beach is now coming into effect, so we'll, we'll get to the pipe, but I do got the pipe fixed in the water, so that's good, but once I get this spread out, it's going to look really nice. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm gonna stop on that. Whew. Yeah, that was a little much. I need my rock. Man, the fish are all in there. That's cool. But I'm gonna go ahead and uh, bring one more load over here, dump it over there, try and blade it out the best I can, and then I'll come back with a rake on another day and really fine tune the beach here. But yeah, let's do one more load of, let's do one more load of sand. Look at that. That was like a rewind effect. Boop. More special effects. 
Check out whatever's down there is going after something. A couple of brim. All the minnows are up here hiding. Oh, wow. ow, it's a pricker there. Cool Nestle. Trash. We gotta find that pipe or what? You guys wanna find the pipe or you wanna do the sand? Um, mm -hmm. Look, the oven door's always open. I don't know why. What do you want to do? I mean, the pipe should be pretty easy. I don't think that's going to be too difficult. Let's finish the sand. Let's not get sidetracked. Let's stay on track. And then uh, let's let's do the sand. That way we stay on track. Well, I'm thinking the pipe should be somewhere in here. So let's go ahead and uh, find that pipe. No sign of it yet. I'm gonna go ahead and get the shovel, kind of trench through there. That way I don't break it. I don't have to repair another piece of the pipe. Plus I don't have no pipe to repair it with, so. Yeah, let me grab the shovel real quick. Definitely seems like it should be in the direct line. Hopefully it don't steer off somewhere in here going back over towards the pump. But if you remember correctly, when I found a pipe coming off the pump, it actually went underneath, I believe, that shed right there. So I think it came out. That was an extension put on. I do not know. So I think it goes underneath there and then comes out and attaches some over here. So that's why I'm hoping I can find it right in here. Then I'll know, put this back, I'll do another one over there. And just tear what the hell's ranch all up. So what the hell's, right? I mean, it seems like what the hell's ranch is flooding. Watch with the, ah, watch with the tractor so you let your head, Travis. Well, too late for that. I'm just gonna poke down deep enough so I can get another scoop of the tractor. That way it falls. It's a lot easier that way. So. Plus my elbow's not working too good right now. No. Okay, I think we can dig it some more. Still no pipe. So I guess we'll get back to the beach for now. Oh, this pipe is just, uh, I'm gonna find it, cause you know why? Where there's a Willis, there's a way. Maybe I'll do, I'll do uh, one more. Oops, I kicked the bucket over there, so I'll run it over. I'll do one more just a little, a little bit deeper, and that's about as deep as I can go. I don't think it's gonna be much deeper than that. Still no sign of a pipe. Ah, sorry about that little rattling. That's that ring thing on my thing. Ring thing on my thing. Well, where do I dig next? Where do I? Oh, I was supposed to be going to get in the sand because I'm tired of trying to dig and find this pipe. We're going to put that dirt back. We filled the rabbit hole back. I'm back over here to the pump. Just, I mean, it's right there and right there. I guess if I dig a trench from one side to the other all the way across, I'd find it. Oh man, I don't know what I'm gonna do now. Con has water in it though. I'm back. All right, I'll pick up those few pieces of roots I cut up. Uh, the rain will settle it in, the grass will grow back, and it'll be fine. But what the heck was I doing? Or what the hell's was I doing? Not what the hell's ranch? What the hell's am I doing? Wonder what the hell's Jeremy's doing? Man, there, there's some fish in here already. Look at this. I think it's just a bigger fish. They finally got more room to swim. Every time I film, they stop chasing their little fish. 
So coming over here and check out the pond on this side, it's pretty cool, man. It's uh, definitely cool. Once I get more of the beach over there, now I'm not sure if I was pointing at you guys or not, but once I get more of the beach over there, that's gonna look really nice along that edge. Finish and complete the dock. We got a good, good bit of water in it now. So once we get that pipe fixed and figured out, and we'll start getting the water going in here. We got the fountain hooked up. I mean, it's coming along. It's coming along really well. I'm really excited about it. I hope you guys are excited as well. I'm glad I got all the trash out of it. Got as much as I could get out of it while it was low. But uh, for now, look, a big old frog just raining in the water. But for now, the pond is back. If you remember, if you remember last time, those hog wallers were right down there. The water was like right in here. It was just a little puddle over there. But it's definitely gonna look good with that beach, for sure. Then once the water fills up, it's gonna be nice to go into it. You see the cinder block under there? Uh, before I put the pipe together top, I'll put it back through it and slide it back down to hold the pipe down in the water. That's what it was doing before. And we'll do that again, but in time. Man, I might just try and put sand all along this whole swimming area right here. That might be a good idea. I gotta cut that out, obviously. There's, there's a lot of work to do, but it's, you know, if, if you didn't see it from before, go back and see it from before and compare it to now. So I'm getting the beach there. Little by little, I gotta get the rake. It's gonna make it a lot easier to kind of get this stuff kind of raked out and raked up over there and filled in there and then a nice smooth edge up to the grass. And then when the water fills in, it'll be the nice sand bottom right there. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, I tried to do it with the shovel, but uh, the shovel is just, my elbow's really been bothering me. And so uh, that's not gonna happen today, but still got a little bit of trash to pick out there, a little bit more. Man, it's gonna be cool. If you see what I see, it's gonna be awesome. I just can't help it, I just can't stop. Look, I think Mr. Duck and Mr. Pig are having a staring contest.